G'day everyone and welcome back. Now I'm out here today doing a bit of maintenance on my PX1 Ranger and judging by the rough condition that I purchased this car in, I doubt it's had any maintenance done on it. So this should make an interesting video. So I'm just gonna be replacing the fuel filter in it. But what I wanna do is inspect the housing and see how bad the filter is on this because I doubt it's probably been changed in a very long time. But I've already undone the clips here. So it's gonna pull that out, should come straight out. Damn, that looks nasty. All right, let's have a bit of a close look at this filter. Um, yeah, that is bad. Oh man, it's stuck in there. Holy dooly, look at that. This thing has not been changed for a very long time. I've actually never seen a filter in such a bad condition. Like the whole thing is essentially falling apart. Holy dooly, you can't even see into it. All right, I gotta tip some of that out, see what's at the bottom. Oh man, that's bad. Far out, that is super bad. So this is why Ford Ranger engines fail, because of this stuff. So this is how we should be looking like, and this is what we are looking like. So oh, man. That is bad. Definitely the worst one I've ever seen. It's um, completely come apart. Now this is a prime example of why these engines fail. Obviously, no maintenance is done. Dirt gets into injectors, they get stuck open, burn a hole in the piston, next thing you know, you've got a dead engine. This is why it's important to keep up with your regular maintenance and not let this happen. I reckon this engine probably had maybe another five to 10,000 kilometers before something similar would have happened. I am a little bit worried about these injectors, so I will have to test them and see how they're functioning, but I'll probably do that in another video. So until then, and I'll see you guys later.